Hi, it's Jen Gilbert, and one of the aspects of medical practice management that can either be a true joy, possibly a true pain, probably a mixture of both, is dealing with the hiring, the training, and then the managing of your staff. Now, this is one of the areas where running a medical practice is really no different than managing any other business that's out there. So, how do you deal with the aspect of managing your practice? One of the biggest potential problems, as with any other business that's out there, is going to be the high turnover rates. High staff turnover can happen, quite honestly, for any number of reasons. However, why it's actually happening doesn't really matter in terms of your practice's bottom line. For every employee you, you lose, you're going to have to spend an additional three to five thousand dollars in lost productivity and then the cost of finding, hiring, and training a brand new person. Clearly, you want to manage your practice to avoid as much turnover as possible and here are some suggestions to do just that. Now, particularly as the economy starts to recover, your employees might just start looking for better salaries elsewhere. Obviously, one of the best ways to manage this issue is to make sure that you are paying at least the industry average for your area. No one wants to find out that someone is making a lot more money doing basically the same exact job. But salary is not enough. Employees do want to know that their work is valued and that they matter to you and the practice. So how do you achieve this? First of all, frequent recognition and small rewards like gift certificates are a huge help in this area. Maybe do recognition luncheons once a quarter, flowers on birthdays, or rotate half-day Fridays during the summer months when appointment schedules are down. There are so many ways that you can show that you care and value your staff. Sometimes a simple smile and a thank you will save you thousands of dollars. I invite you to visit with me, learn more at my blog. All of my information is below and I do look forward to seeing you there. Please take care.